up, buddy nerdigans? This is the one and only Packer Girl 89, and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Shimatsu no Valkyrie, aka Record of Ragnarok, chapter 54. So, before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And, of course, because this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored, and I'm just on a high speed, non stop struggle train heading into chaos. If you love what I'm doing, I want to help keep this channel and myself in my kitty who is hiding somewhere alive and a kicking. Feel free to hit up my cash up and PayPal. Those links are in the description box below. So last chapter, holy fucking shit. Last chapter was so goddamn epic because we finished up the Broda Hajun fight and it was epic because we saw a boy Sarafuka come together with Broda. And form that epic sword. And it was just so cool seeing them wipe Hajun away and finish up that puberty. <laughs> it was epic as shit. Oh my god, it was so epic. I don't know how we're gonna top this fight. How are we gonna top this? How? Ooh, I can't wait to find out. Also, before I forget, of course, if you are not um, following me on Twitter or if you've not seen, of course, my Kuragani no Valhallen content, if you are not reading Kuragani no Valhallen, go do it. It is so fucking good. Trust and believe you will love that series if you ha have not started reading it already, which, guess what? I'm covering it right after this, so... Anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us today. And this chapter is titled Substitute. Dude, look how wrecked this fucking field is. Look at that shit. It goes red. Look at fucking a chud. Look what's left of a chud. Blurp. <laughs> Broda, yeah! Broda, Broda! Cheer for my boy. Yes. Everyone loves him. Because he is the Broda. He is the moment. Damn straight. He. <laughs> let me read this. Let me say this again. He is the bro. He is the moment. He is the Broda. <laughs> Go. So that's the Broda. I never knew he was so strong. What unbelievable willpower. Damn straight. You. What is with the mofos underestimating people? What is it? First it was Kaki up a kingdom, and now it's Broda? Why are you mofos be underestimating? Stop! Stop, stop, stop! Whoa! You too, huh? Seems like it wasn't just me. Whoa! Look at everyone! Oh. Broda! Broda! It seems like it wasn't just me who loves, who loves Zero! Oh! cousin that was basically his brother to him. I'm telling you, Zerofuku was his cousin reincarnated, his bro slash cousin reincarnated. Telling ya! Here we go. Bro! Uh, Buchan! <laughs> I love this man! Can we, can we just protect him? I love him! Bro! We're reaching the sick bay now. Don't die on us, Broda. Buchan, what? What? Broda, uh, thank you for uh, thank you for your assistance. You saved us yet. You saved us yet again. Well, I have Diet Cola. I've got Pepsi. Deal with it. I love my Diet Soda. 
You're never going to take that away from me. I... <laughs> to mankind's survival. There you go again. Dude, he's just like turning over to... <laughs> um, I'll, there you go again, all stubborn like. Dude, I'm telling you, Broda is a total... The, the, see, many reasons why I call Buddha the bro... Uh, call him Broda. This is just one of them. He's such a bro. He's a bro. That's all right. You know, Buchan, I really like your eyes full of worldly desires. Daddy, <laughs> Worldly desire? What did Broda mean by that? <laughs> she knows! Oh, Broda! She thirsty for that bro. She thirsty for Broda. That's what it is. Woo! Back to Beelzebub. <gasps> some good shit even though oh my god the ship would be buddha holy shit i just realized this think about it if this ship happened between buchan and, Bo and, and broda it'd be buddha oh my god this is a trip this is a goddamn trip holy shit the shipper, the dude, my shipping mind was just blown. It was just blown into next week. Holy crap! Dude! The Buddha ship! Oh my god, let's go, let's go! Okay, now let's get let's get into the let's get into the serious shit here. So so that was oh my god. Oh my god, I can't! I can't! Okay. So that was your doing all along, Beel. Oh my God! So that was your doing all along, Beelzebub. Yes! Beelzebub's not even bothered by this. He's just like, he's like, I'm doing my thing. <laughs> he doesn't even notice you, Odin. Oh, we got a yin yang motif as well with Beelzebub and Odin. Well, Odin's a walking, fucking Mago Illuminati himself with this freaking crows. But dude, look at that shit. Just look at that. That is a fucking uh, uh, Maga Illuminati, period. Hey, don't ignore us. Y yeah, fuck you, Fly. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Fly White. <laughs> hey, don't ignore us. Yeah, fuck you, Fly White. You want to go, huh? You were doing some weird experiment again, weren't you, you fucking creep? I have... <gasps> ah, I knew it. I fucking knew it. I have waited a long, long time in preparation for this battle. I will print permit no one to disrupt it a long long time how intriguing i knew oh it was up to some shit i knew it i knew it i knew it my typical hotness was i was not wrong on this remember i said that odin was up to some shit i said it i said odin was up to some shit, and the fact that Beelzebub is gonna go along with this, and remember the lore, you know, in the mythos, Beelzebub had uh, 
had some fun back in the day. He had some fun trying to uh, overthrow uh, Hades. He was trying to do a coup. Ooh, we're going to have some fun with this. We're going to try it and overthrow Zeus, aren't we? I told you, Mofos. I told you! I knew it! With this, um, with this match, the score is three to three. All tied up again, it seems. To be served, uh, defeat on top of Buddha's, um, uh, top of Brodus' betrayal is a most bitter loss for us indeed. If we are to suffer yet another defeat at their hands, the tide of the tournament could easily and quickly turn in their favor. Yes, which means whether right or wrong, we must win this next round by any means necessary. Ooh, Zeus triggered. Ah, by the way, dude, I swear to God, the Kengen of it all. Yes, I know. We have a Kengen situation up in this bitch. You cannot deny it's true. Ah, uh, by the way, what do you intend to do about Broda Slut? They are strong. We can't be too careful about whom we select. Yes, that is what that is what I was thinking as well. Hmm? Huh? What? Why is it be me? Oh yes, I might mightn't seem it seem it, but I am a god of war after all. Speaking of in Kurogani no Valhallen, we got the reincarnation of the god of war. Ours. Yes we do! And it is fucking glorious. Oh, I can't wait to cover this, cover that manga after this. Oh my god, the art is also fantastic as well. It's only natural the gods are placing their expectations on me. Hmm. Mm hmm. Right. Then I'll wait. 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 Mankind's way more powerful than I had imagined. If worse comes to worse, I'll be annihilated too. Could they win against uh, against me? But if I back out, um, here, my praise the god of war will be... Nay. Nay! Stop double-guessing yourself. You have to win here for Valhalla. In the name of the twelve gods of Olympus. Don't be scared, Ares. Rise to the occasion, Ares. You can do it. <laughs> Ares, straight of thought thus far, it lasted 25 seconds. I, 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 I'll, I, I shall go. What? <gasps> Beelzebub. Oh my god, if you're telling me right now we're gonna have Hades versus Beelzebub, I will fucking die. Please. You, Hades? The ruler of Helheim? You'll join the fray yourself? Oh, uh -huh. whatever's gotten it into you, King of Helheim? Hm, a foolish question. With an obvious answer. This is revenge for my dear brother Poseidon. Yeah! Dude, I'm excited for this shit. I'm telling you, we are going to get something very interesting up in here. Oh my god, I swear to fucking god, if we see, like, oh my god. I swear to god, if we see fucking Poseidon, or not Poseidon, if we see Beelzebub up in this bitch, I will die. Please do it! Because we are have a planned coop up in here. I want to see Beelzebub versus Hades. Give me it! Give me Beelzebub versus Hades! This would be the time for it! Oh my god, please, please, I am begging you, manga gods, up above and beyond. Give me Hades versus Beelzebub, please. Please do it. Oh my god. You are planning a coup de tat for crying out loud. I want my Hades versus Beelzebub. Can you imagine having Hades versus Beelzebub? Holy shit, that would be boss. That would be some boss shit if we had Hades versus Beelzebub. Oh my god, I, I need that in my life. I need that. I need that. Oh god. All right. If we don't have Beelzebub in here... Who would we have? Well, we do have Okita left, which is true. Which, you know what? I would not be surprised if we have Okita up in this bitch next. I would not. And I would I be mad by it? No. I would love to see Okita versus, uh, um, versus Hate. Dude, Okita versus Hades would be fucking lit too. I would not be mad at this either. But, goddamn, I really want Beelzebub up in this bitch. I do! Oh, Beelzebub, Beelzebub and Odin working against 
and working together. Beelzebub content. I told you motherfuckers Odin was planning a coup. What do you think Beelzebub is going to do? Because Beelzebub seems really intrigued by it. And the fact that Hades is entering the fray, this is no coincidence. No coincidence at all. And Hades of all people, of all times, all times for, some, for Hades to step into the fray now. And you saw Hades was wearing that patch on his eye. Methinks Hades saw something going down. I think Hades saw what was going down with Beelzebub and Odin. Oh, damn straight. I think there, because this can't be more than a coincidence, right? That's what, that's my guess. It's got to be either... Be, it's got to be either Okita or Beelzebub. Or Beelzebub, or Beelzebub's going to manipulate the fuck out of shit. But damn, I want to see Beelzebub up in here. I want to see Beelzebub say, come up and say, look. I was, uh, Beelzebub be like, I was fucking around and I want to take charge. Now. I have business. I want Beelzebub to come up and say, look, I got business. And come up and take care of it and come and get Sadie's. Please just give me that. I need that in my life. I need that. I just, like, you know what? Why can't I have my cake and eat it too? Why not? Why does it have to be one or the other? It could be. This could be it. This could be it. Where we have the situation here. Where this is kind of like, in Ken, I gotta compare it to Kengan Omega for a minute here. Because in Kengan Omega, we had this turning point, right? Where um, it was, I think the real turning point was Naiden versus uh, Ryuki. And we found out, uh, you know, about the, um, the final Omega. And then shit just went down from there. It just kept getting crazier and crazier and crazier. I feel like that turning point up in here was obviously the Buddha versus... Um, uh, the Buddha versus Zerofuku match we just had. That was our turning point. Um, and yeah, you can make the argument that the uh, that the Raiden match could have been our turning point because goddamn that fight was good as uh, good as well. But God, I really feel like this was our turning point. And uh, part of me wants to say this was like our Kanawagito fight in in a way. God, I really want to say that. I do because we had because you can make the argument that the other. Nico uh, up in this bitch. What if... <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna make the argument that Odin is like the other Nico up in here. I'm making, damn it, I'm making Kenny Omega a fucking comparison, so whatever. But I feel like we're gonna have Beelzebub meddling up in here. So we're gonna have the fight going on between Hades and Okita, and then, and then Beelzebub gonna be meddling. That's what he could be doing. He'll just be meddling. And then maybe he'll enter, he'll do something halfway. I'm very curious what you guys think. I know Beelzebub's going to be doing something up in this bitch. He will. This, this tournament is, this tournament was already, you know, turned upside down by what, what, by what Buddha did, by what Broda did. Oh, damn straight. It's going to, something going to go down up in this fight. And I think, and again, this is why Hades is going up in there. It's not just... Poseidon is just an excuse. It's a good excuse. Avenging Poseidon is a good excuse, but ooh, I'm telling you, he saw, he saw fucking, um, he had to have seen Beelzebub talking with Odin. I'm calling that shit now. I will put my temple hat on. I want to know, do you guys think Hades saw what was going down between Odin and Beelzebub and the, the plans to like overthrow everything for this coup de tot? 
I got a feeling he did. Just something tells me. Something very sus going on. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdy Inc. If you love what I'm doing, I want to help keep this channel alive and kick it so I can keep bringing you more Record of Ragnarok content. There's a few ways you could do that. You can donate to my cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I'll be seeing you later. Bye.